You got clutch. What's going on, people? It's your main man, Johnny Clutch Cards, aka Johnny Clutch Crypto, back again with another Vapor Nodes update. So, um, last we talked, we were talking about all the updates and changes that had been proposed in the proposal for the tax changes and the uh, bonus changes, things of that nature. Um, and that did pass. And so, as you can see here now, um, we are still in diamonds hand mode and we are now getting 1.3 instead of 1.4%. And our compound bonus has dropped from uh, 20%, 25% to 20%, right? So it's still working through some of the other, other pieces to get the rest of this involved. But as you can see, we now have our nodes up to Every node is up to over 2,000. This is the last one. That's why it's the lowest. I compounded it by itself, um, which you can do. So you can select these one at a time and hit compound. And even though it says compound all, it means all that are selected, basically. And you can compound one node and two nodes. And when you compound, as we saw last time, it does not affect your diamond hands uh, status. So that's a positive, too. Um, the other thing that kind of take into account is right, right now we're kind of down, like, so we're down here to 2.4 cents, two and a half cents, um, on VPND. And if I'm not mistaken, I believe, I believe VPN, uh, I believe Avalanche is up. So, um, the reason I bring this up is because, because of that fact, Right, Avalanche, Avalanche is down three percent over the last seven days, but but up one point six percent over the last twenty four hours. Whereas VPND is down thirty six percent over the last seven days. So this is a great time that if you have a lot of VPND built up, that you might want to go ahead and pull it out because now you're going to pay less Avalanche to pull it out. If that makes sense, right? Because the value of Avalanche against VPND is wider than what it normally is, than, or than what it is when VPND is higher and Avalanche is lower. So it's a, it's a, this actually is a good opportunity that if you have a large amount of VPND that maybe you want to hold um, for you know for you know, whatever reason, this is a good time to pull it out and not wait until VPND runs back up and Avalanche falls to kind of. You know, save yourself a little bit of AVAX in that transaction um, with the way the new taxes break out. So keep in mind, instead of paying a VPND out of your VPND when you pull out, now that percentage that you pay to withdraw is going to be an AVAX. So keep that in mind. So now is a very good time to, you know, if you want, if I wanted to stash this 15, 1600 uh, a VPND. Um, and pay a little bit less in tax, I this is the time to do it. Go ahead and do it now and have it sitting there. And then when VPND runs up, then all you're doing is exchanging your VPND for whatever other currency uh, you want, whether that be, um, you know, DAI or BUSD or Avalanche or whatever it is, right? So keep that in mind. This is a good time to do that. Um, the, the, the only other thing to kind of really note is that um, I believe that, you know, there's some additional things coming. I think the Vapor Army was talking about, you know, diamond hands. This is all stuff there. But they got a bunch of stuff coming um, coming down the, the pipeline. As always, we can always jump into, where's the, the bank link? One second here. Snow Trace, C Chain. I know I saw the, the bank link. All right. Let's take a look at the, the bank link. But if it knows we have upgraded a smart contract, please. All right. So these are the updates that they made here. And, you know, this kind of goes through some of the investors um, that are there in that particular proposal. All right. So if we jump back here, um, we're doing pretty good here. And this 1% is, you know, we're making $3.42. Three dollars and forty-two cents per day, um, which is you know, give or take a hundred and twenty, hundred and thirty VPND at this current price. 
And, you know, we'll wait for it to go back up to, you know, maybe up around, you know, seven, eight cents before we, you know, do any more exchanging of VPND. And then we just want to take these moments to kind of stockpile VPND because then what will happen is as we stockpile our VPND, we, you know, we'll be able to build our bag up and look for a real cash out here. Um, and that's really all I got. You know, I think uh, things are still moving in a positive direction. There are AMAs weekly with uh, Vaporfy. Um, so, and the team still seems to be very engaged. And uh, Vapor Chain is supposed to be on the, on, on the horizon. So I'm hoping to get some more information along when that's going to happen and what that looks like and how that's going to affect this overall project. You know, particularly when you start to think about how strong has been affected by uh, the promise of strong chain and you know those prices have continued to go down so just another day in the life of a no DeFi investor here with vapor nodes um, this is obviously not financial advice this is just a guy showing you what I do in the DeFi space so uh, if you find it interesting feel free to leave a like uh, the content interesting leave a like subscribe to the page Leave me a comment down below. Let me know what your thoughts are on this project or what is your favorite no project. Leave me a comment down below. Let me know what is your favorite no project so I can look into that project. Is it strong? Is it vapor? Is it comb? Is it something that's died already? Is it something that's on the way? Um, as always, I'm your main man, Johnny Clutch Cards, a.k.a. Johnny Clutch Crypto. I'm always for the people, by the people. You only got me and the Constitution. Remember that.